So today we have this little baby. Oh, it is the yes. Nintendo Entertainment System NES Classic Edition. It's very long, but I just like to call it the NES. The baby. The baby. The <laughs> NES baby. Um, not official name. No. But look how clean it is. Yes. It's so let's, cute. Let's take a look at this. We are going to get to some games, but first, I think we need to spend a little bit of time just examining this. Yes. Now, uh, oh, I grew up with uh, the NES. Yes, I as did, did I. You did as, as well. did I. Yes. My first gaming system um, was the NES. And there's just so many of the little details that are reflected here. Like when you turn it on, you actually push the like power the button. Teeny, and it, tiny it's not plugged in, button. and then that red light goes on, and you're yeah. going to use the reset button. Obviously, you can't open the cartridge no. door because you're not using cartridges. But um, and of course, we're not using uh, the same cables. We no. have HDMI uh, and just a power cable is all you need. And um, and then we also have the controller here. Right. So the controller is cool because although the system is a baby, the controller is the actual size right. of the NES Normal controller. size. Normal size. So I don't know. When I picked it up, again, I was like, it feels small. But I think maybe because I was a no. child, and my hands oh, were smaller. Oh, interesting but it's, point. But it's the same size right. as the original NES system controller. And, and of course, the, yeah, I mean. But there's like, you know, all the classics are here. Like Zelda and Mario. Look at this. There's also like... Really cool, like bubble bobble. Yeah, I play yeah, this so games much. From, from companies other than Nintendo. Final yes, Fantasy. Final Fantasy. These massive games. Yes. One player. I really like how it tells you what's a one player game. Yes. Two player game. Exactly. That's really nice. That's really nice. Mega Man Two. Yeah. Balloon Fight. Donkey Kong. Doctor Mario. One of my favorites. Yes. You don't like. We this we have prepared a list. Um, of if you are new to the NES, oh, our top yes. our top five musts to okay. start with, and it, it is on the screen now. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> we really duked it out over this list. Sure did. Yes, you made all sorts of concessions to me. No, like, I didn't. Kit, that is a great point. You were totally right. I never said. Let's put that on the I list. I have never said those things no, ever. Say. This is. So that's the list. Yes, yes, great. So there's all things you can do that's really cool. Like the, you can change the this display. Is the so, Pixel Perfect, which we have on the Nintendo 3DS mm -hmm. as well, so you can do that for your 3DS um, virtual console games, which is great. There is the standard 4x3, so, I mean, it nicely puts the game out on your, your flat screen TV, mm -hmm. which is great. But my personal favorite, mm. if you want to relive your childhood, CRT filter, which is awesome. So we'll, we'll play the first yeah. game with a CRT filter and maybe like the second game without so we mm -hmm. see the difference. One of many, but we're not done. No. no. Let's go back. We're go we want to play, what was oh, there's a game that really struck my eye here. Yes. Yeah. And we're going to need to do the We're switch switching. We're switching here, here. For certain reasons. Someone, someone needs to drive this, um, not me. <laughs> I really love the Contra games. Yeah. And we have here, look at, this little, look, at, look at this little row of classic Konami games. Right. Kind of it's Gradius, so great. Super C. So we're going to go to Super C. And when we, were, when we were going through this before, the Omni is the Konami code. Right. And then it struck me, this is one of the few games that did not use the traditional Konami code. So you had to look up the other right, Konami I, code. Exactly. So Let's talk about how you can save your amazing product. Oh, wow. Look at that. Okay, so I'll good job. Keep going. Yes. Let's save. That you should you, area two. You got to go to a different level. So we're going to save. We're going to save. Ready? You hit reset. I'm you hit ready. Down on your D pad. Look at that. And then you hold down the A button. Hold it down. Look there at you that. Go. Beautiful. So you see how there are four save slots four per, per right. game. And that, uh, and when we're going through the menu, there's sort of four circles. You can see how many you're, you're mm -hmm. using for each. Yes. Correct. Yes. You can you can move the slots. You can even lock it. Hit down again. You can lock oh. it so that no one can like randomly a push a weird button and like, like delete you. it. Yeah. Me. Like, I'm gonna, I am. At, I'm gonna delete you. his game. I'm gonna delete your game right after you stop playing. Not too bad. The, the bad I'm only on the second level too. Bad it's attitude fine. that you have, and then you can go back to it, whatever, which is very nice. Not in the original NES games. B but, believe it or not, no, it wasn't. Yeah. But there's controversy <laughs> around for store points, friends. Okay, so that is a quick look at the Nintendo Entertainment System NES Classic Edition, or in my favorite way to call it, the Baby NES.